Test 6. Part 1. Look at Part 1. Now we are ready to start. For each question, choose the correct answer. 1. What has the woman received for her birthday? That's a really nice necklace, Sue. Did Brian buy it for you for your 30th birthday? No, he hasn't bought me anything yet because he's going to take me shopping to buy a new coat. I saw one I like in the local clothes shop. Well, that will be nice for your holiday this winter. Yes, and I need one to go with the new boots that my mother bought me as a birthday gift. They are leather and very comfortable. I wonder what the kids will get me this year. Now listen again. That's a really nice necklace, Sue. Did Brian buy it for you for your 30th birthday? No, he hasn't bought me anything yet because he's going to take me shopping to buy a new coat. I saw one I like in the local clothes shop. Well, that will be nice for your holiday this winter. Yes, and I need one to go with the new boots that my mother bought me as a birthday gift. They are leather and very comfortable. I wonder what the kids will get me this year. Two. What did the boy forget to buy? Oh no, you forgot to get the apples. I need them for the fruit salad I was going to prepare for the barbecue party. They didn't have any, so I got some bananas instead. I thought about buying strawberries, but they were a bit expensive. Well, at least you remember the white bread and the meat. Otherwise, you and your sister would go hungry. Let's have some bread, butter and jam for now. Sam, where's the butter? Oops, the butter slipped my mind completely, Mum. Now listen again. Oh no, you forgot to get the apples. I need them for the fruit salad I was going to prepare for the barbecue party. They didn't have any, so I got some bananas instead. I thought about buying strawberries, but they were a bit expensive. Well, at least you remember the white bread and the meat. Otherwise, you and your sister would go hungry. Let's have some bread, butter and jam for now. Sam, where's the butter? Oops, the butter slipped my mind completely, Mum. Three. What is the date of the party? Hi, Jill. Are you going to Bob's birthday party on the 27th of March? It's going to be a big event. He has invited all our friends from school. Oh, I thought the party was on the 26th. I must have put it down wrong in my diary. It's on Friday at 7 in the evening at the Palace Hotel. So which day is that? Well, I know Sunday is the 27th of March, as it's my cousin's birthday, so I guess we were both wrong after all. Now listen again. Hi Jill, are you going to Bob's birthday party on the 27th of March? It's going to be a big event. He has invited all our friends from school. Oh, I thought the party was on the 26th. I must have put it down wrong in my diary. It's on Friday at 7 in the evening at the Palace Hotel. So which day is that? Well, I know Sunday is the 27th of March, as it's my cousin's birthday, so I guess we were both wrong after all. Four. What's the weather like now? Wow, that was some storm. I thought that rain would never stop. The whole garden was completely flooded. It's destroyed all my mum's flowers. And the lightning was terrifying, wasn't it? Yes, and the thunder was very loud. It scared my dog and he hid under my bed until it stopped. At least it's cleared up in time for the barbecue. Let's put the umbrellas up. We don't want anyone to get too much sun on their faces. I think it is also time to start the fire for the barbecue. Can you get the wood for me, please? Now listen again. Wow, that was some storm. I thought that rain would never stop. The whole garden was completely flooded. It's destroyed all my mum's flowers. 
And the lightning was terrifying, wasn't it? Yes, and the thunder was very loud. It scared my dog and he hid under my bed until it stopped. At least it's cleared up in time for the barbecue. Let's put the umbrellas up. We don't want anyone to get too much sun on their faces. I think it is also time to start the fire for the barbecue. Can you get the wood for me, please? Five. What form of transport is unaffected? And finally, the recent travel news in your area. Due to the very bad weather, all shipping across the sea to France and Spain has been stopped for now. The wind is too strong for ships to sail safely. Freezing weather has created problems for most train services in the area, so passengers are advised to check the internet before they travel to the station. All roads are now passable for any parents trying to get their children from school. No more snow is expected, but we will be back later for an update. Now listen again. And finally, the recent travel news in your area. Due to the very bad weather, all shipping across the sea to France and Spain has been stopped for now. The wind is too strong for ships to sail safely. Freezing weather has created problems for most train services in the area, so passengers are advised to check the internet before they travel to the station. All roads are now passable for any parents trying to get their children from school. No more snow is expected, but we will be back later for an update. Six. What is the man's job? I'm sorry, but it's going to be difficult to drop you off right outside the museum, as the traffic is terrible there. The traffic wardens give you a ticket almost before the car has stopped. You can either pay now, and if there is no one in front of the museum, you can get out quickly, or I will have to take you around the corner, and you can get out just outside the police station. It's only two minutes' walk from there. I guess little Anne and I are going to walk a bit. That's okay. Now listen again. I'm sorry, but it's going to be difficult to drop you off right outside the museum, as the traffic is terrible there. The traffic wardens give you a ticket almost before the car has stopped. You can either pay now, and if there is no one in front of the museum, you can get out quickly, or I will have to take you around the corner, and you can get out just outside the police station. It's only two minutes' walk from there. I guess little Anne and I are going to walk a bit. That's okay. Seven. Where is Billy now? Billy's been at the park for a long time. He left the house at about ten o'clock this morning. He should be back soon. I think he went to the afternoon showing of the latest Disney film with Peter. Oh, I thought he was still in the park. In that case, he should be home in about an hour then. No. He'll be much later, as he's going to go for a pizza with his friends from school after the film. They always meet up once a month. Now listen again. Billy's been at the park for a long time. He left the house at about ten o'clock this morning. He should be back soon. I think he went to the afternoon showing of the latest Disney film with Peter. Oh, I thought he was still in the park. In that case, he should be home in about an hour then. No, he'll be much later, as he's going to go for a pizza with his friends from school after the film. They always meet up once a month. That is the end of part one.